Hey, hello guys, welcome back to another video by me, Pejas, and today I am very, very excited to bring you guys some crazy news about Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. If you go onto your game right now, for free, you can pick up the brand new NV4 variant called the Honey Badger. This is absolutely insane, and I'm so happy that they finally brought this variant to Infinite Warfare. This is a variant I've seen could be possibly uh, implemented in the game for a very, very long time, because the NV4 is very similar to the Honey Badger from Call of Duty Ghost. He's originally from that game and that weapon could perfectly be a variant of the NV4 and they finally actually did it. Basically what this allows you, if you do remember of the Honey Badger in Call of Duty Ghost, it was able to have a silencer even without changing any attachments. It basically came with suppressor if you wanted it or not. And the same thing is here in Infinite Warfare. It's kind of like the VPR Yokai in, in a sense because you have to have a suppressor on the weapon but it does not cost you any attachments whatsoever. I played around with it today and it was so much fun. You actually reminded me of Call of Duty Ghost and the Honey Badger was my favorite weapon from that game. Not that Call of Duty Ghost was a great game, but this weapon is absolutely insane. So all you need to do is to turn on your PlayStation right now or Xbox, wherever you play on, go into the game and you can find the hack right there and open it and you are all good to go. It was actually really, really nice of Infinity War to actually allowing us to just get this for free. You don't have to get it through supply drops or everything. Everybody gets it. And you have only about two to three days to go up and pick it up. So log on and pick it up. If you can't play at the moment for this weekend, just go on your PlayStation or Xbox and pick up the gun as fast as you can because it will expire eventually out from what I can see on the screen there from the event or like the free uh, thing that you get. So definitely go ahead and pick up the gun. How is it like though? It's basically like the NV4. It's not changed in a lot of ways. It still feels like the NV4, but it has the looks like the flatline in the game, or maybe more the chaos. It looks amazing. It looks a little bit more similar to uh, the Honey Badger itself instead of the standard NV4, which I really like, which is really disappointing with like the Volk Retro and the Volk uh, Vintage. None of them actually look like the AK-47, but the Honey Badger looks different, which I really, really like. It's a very good gun, you have to have suppressor, and honestly, NV4 is really good with suppressor anyway, so I don't see any downfall of actually using that. And of course, you don't have to spend an attachment on it if you want it, and if you want more range, you can put on uh, an extended barrel, or whatever it's called in the game, rifle barrel, uh, so you can use that. Uh, my favorite class setup with this weapon is uh, quick draw, grip. You don't need a grip on the NV4, but it has a little bit more recoil than it used to have in the game. It's a long time ago where, where they changed that, but I like a grip on the NV4 because it's a laser beam with it. Uh, so I used grip, um, quick draw, as well as stock, and then I used rifle barrel. Or you can switch it over to Extendamax. That's probably the best setup I will give you guys for this weapon. Really, really, really fun to use. And I honestly really, really recommend you guys to not use any optic on this game. Uh, on this weapon, I mean, so you can have the feel of the Honey Badger. Because I think majority of us actually played back in the days with the Honey Badger without a scope. And if you really want that feeling again, drop a scope just for this variant and try it out. It's probably better with the scope and more accurate. I was struggling with some of my shots too because I'm not used to the Iron Sight at all. Not that the Enemy Force Iron Sight is really bad or this variant at all, but I just really prefer a... Uh, uh, ELO or like a red dot because you will be a lot more accurate. A lot of the gunfights I went in today I struggled with just because that I didn't use a red dot because I'm so used to having that or a ELO. So that's definitely the best class that, uh, that I have for you guys. As well, they also added a new bundle. I'm going to cover that in another video coming up very, very soon. So stay tuned for that where we as well get the VPR nuke variant. Super, super exciting. Basically, the new bundle allows you to get a few supply drops, a Mark II hack as well as a new a little package or like an open box or whatever you want to call it, like a hack where you get some of the new stuff that's recently added into the game uh, and you can, for example, get the VPR nuke variant from that, all the supply drops or of course the Mark II pack. I'm not going to spoil it, I'm going to wait for that video later. But today's all about the Honey Badger. Uh, unfortunately, I wasn't able to play this gameplay live, that's why I'm commentating over it because I just wanted to try the game. I haven't been feeling 100% lately, so I just wanted to chill and play the game, but I got so excited and I feel a little bit better at the moment Moment, so I wanted to make this video for you guys and I hope you are just as excited as I am Jump back on Infinite Warfare if you're not enjoying World War 2. It's a little bit boring at the moment It's a little bit stale jump onto Infinite Warfare and get some playtime with the new Honey Badger If you play Ghost, you're probably gonna enjoy it even more 
So that's it for today, uh, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy this gameplay and also showing off the Honey Badger for the first time in Infinite Warfare. Finally, they brought it. Finally, they brought the VPR and Nuke All the cool stuff is coming to Infinite Warfare right now. I don't know why they waited for this for so long. This is what we've been wanting for such a long time, but here it is at least. So I hope you enjoyed some gameplay footage of this weapon. Definitely will bring you some live gameplays with this weapon in the future, but I just wanted to provide this information for you guys so you know what's going down right now because there's not a lot of people who will inform you on YouTube or anywhere else as I've seen as of right now. So there you go. Try out the Honey Badger yourself. You get it for completely free. Very easy to pick up. And that's all I wanted to say in this video. Thank you so much for all the amazing support on the channel, guys. I really, really appreciate that. And I really, really promise you guys that I will be streaming on this Sunday. Depending on, of course, when you're watching this video. But see you on stream on Sunday. You will also see another video with the BPR Nuke variant. And that's it for now. Take care. Love you all. Be kind to one another. My name is Pejas. And I'm signing out. Mission success. Running diagnostics.